The boundary between biology and engineering is becoming increasingly blurred. And one of the most impressive examples of this convergence is the creation of the world's smallest motor, which was implanted in a fly. The project sounds like something out of a science fiction movie, but it is the result of years of scientific research and advancements in biotechnology. Scientists have managed to implant a tiny motor inside a fly, a milestone in precision engineering and biological robotics. This microscopic motor was carefully designed to function in harmony with the fly's body without hindering its biological functions. The primary goal of this research is to explore how small motors can be used to control the movement of insects, opening doors to revolutionary applications in the field of micro-robotics. Imagine swarms of insects equipped with these motors, capable of monitoring the environment, conducting search and rescue operations in hard-to-reach areas, or even performing highly precise medical operations. The idea of creating a tiny motor to be implanted in a living organism may seem like something from the future but the implications of this technology are vast. The motor is powered by external energy sources and seamlessly integrates with the fly's nervous system, allowing researchers to control some of its movements with remarkable precision. This breakthrough is more than just a scientific feat. It's a paradigm shift that could transform how we use biotechnology in the near future. However, this experiment also raises ethical and philosophical questions about the use of biotechnology and the control of living organisms. While the initial applications may be benign, such as environmental monitoring or assistance in rescue operations, there is growing debate about how far this technology could go and how it may be used. 